Uh, when I heard, first heard about this mural proposal for Galliano, I was a little skeptical actually, um, because I'm a mural painter myself, and I've done a lot of murals, but I thought that it was maybe a little bit big uh, for Galliano. I was really excited right from day one, um, because you know, what a great idea to bring all these artists together and create a big mural to be part of it. It was very exciting. Louis um, Lavoie and Phil Allen, they flew out here and looked at the place, got the feel for it, and said yes, they'd like to do a mural about West Coast life. I was called by Connie from the, from the inn to, to outline the project. And um, she asked me if I would be interested. And I said immediately, no, no, I'm sorry. Thanks for asking me, but I'm not good enough. She said, of course you are. There was a big um, do at the inn where the two fellows, Phil and Lewis, who um, are the organizers behind the mural, came to Galliano and um, brought all the artists that were interested together at the inn. It was a beautiful day in the garden and there were panels in boxes um, that you could go through and look at. For Galliano, we were responsible for hurting artists from Galliano. Hurting artists is something I don't want to do again. It's, 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 uh, it's challenging, it's fun, and they're great people, but it's, yeah, it's challenging. So we went to the inn and we chose our panels. They're 12 inches square. And um, you choose one that speaks to you. And it's just abstract, you know, just lines. But instantly I saw that part of it, I wanted it to be the ocean and the dark part was going to be the night sky, so I knew right away that I was going to do something like that. I decided to do, um, a, well, an ocean theme, and I decided to do it in cartoon style with colored pencils instead of acrylics or oils, which they recommended, but they said it would be okay if I did that. The painting I did was a view from my daughter's house in, uh, up um, over Trincomalee. It's, it's a view of the water a polyapas, and it was uh, an eagle. The eagle was act actually in the tree when the photograph was taken, and um, a sailboat down below, and the sun was setting. And I just put a beach that I'm very familiar with and I've painted many times, I just put it in moonlight, and uh, that worked. That beach uh, means a lot to me, actually. It was a beach near where we first moved when we came to Galliano, 30 some years ago. To be part of something that big was, was really different. I'm not working in isolation as usual. And then this other artist friend of mine, Elsie Mussel, um, she, we used to come to the church and paint every, uh, every Tuesday. And she said, I'll, I'll sit with you. I'll... And she did hers. And, um, and I did mine. And, Eventually, we were a little late, we took them down and they were accepted. When I saw that mural finally unveiled and the actual, actual material thing, I was very impressed. Uh, I really didn't expect it to be quite so rich. Uh, I thought that you'd have to get back further from it to really appreciate it, the whole, the whole concept, but the surface itself is so rich. Everyone went silent when the curtains were pulled apart. Everyone just went silent. It was so awe-inspiring and wonderful. And then we got personal and looked for our own uh, little piece. And um, it was quite a wonderful moment. Oh, I th it was one of the most thrilling moments when it was unveiled and to see the whole piece. Um, and I could see my piece in there. I was very proud to be part of it. It was great. And I was very proud when the Lieutenant Governor asked me which was mine and I pointed up to it and he said that's very typical of the islands, the eagle and the boats. And 
was just an absolutely phenomenal day. It was really wonderful. So when he got to unveil it and pull off the black cloth, and then finally everyone got to see what they were part of, and seeing it um, as large as this is, Punamunks means together, unity, togetherness um, through diversity. Yeah. Yeah. Do I go to Toronto now? They're having a film festival. That's right. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs>